got my good friend, the Tim, Tim from BBI. So BBI is like the only place, and Tim's really the only person that I actually trust to work on my cars, because I usually work on all my cars, but to be quite honest, with 911s, like the step two of every time you're working on a 911 is remove the engine, which just kind of sucks. So these guys, they do all our work, and they, they make do. my car fast, and they make it fun. Anyway, today, he's brought out Project Swan. Yeah. I'm gonna walk around Project Swan, and then I'm gonna convince him to do dumb things in the yard with it, right? We're gonna try. With the small yard, it looks a lot smaller than those on camera. All right, let's check it out. This project started a while back. Um, we ended up just a customer called up, said, "Hey, I've got a 997," and he said, "I don't want to go buy a GT2 because it's too much money." So he gave this list, and he says, "If it was your car and you had a, a budget, what would you do to it?" So we started checking the boxes and came up with that. So what'd you build? So it started life as a 997 Turbo. And now we took a 997 GT3 engine because we wanted a broad rev range. So it spins to 9,000 RPMs. Now the thing screams. Mated that with a sequential gearbox so you don't have to lift the shift, which is really good for a turbo car. See, so this car is two wheel drive because at some yeah. point, yeah. at some point Porsche decided that men weren't men. So like after my car, which is a turbo, and then the 993, yeah. which was a rear wheel drive turbo, mm -hmm. the 996 was only all wheel drive turbo because they didn't think people could handle that much power. So. Yeah. You, guys, no, yeah, you so, guys fixed that problem. So yeah, we fixed that issue. That, that was a big issue though. The all four wheels going at the same time. Converting it to two wheel drive was, was a little bit harder than we anticipated. Then we put all GT3 cup car knuckles and subframes on it. The entire chassis is basically, not, I mean, how you'd section a hot rod or something, but it's completely dropped around so all the geometry is recorrected and then Brembo's and, and here we are. What's like that one thing that you were just really stoked to work on and, and make happen? The engine build. Essentially, this is kind of like a street legal Pikes Peak car that we built. In street trim on 91 octane, it's making 600 and, 600 and change at the ground. The, the essential block heads, cams, and cam power started life from a 997 GT3. So we took the high revving components and the, the big airflow components, dropped the compression, had custom pistons, rods, studs, the whole thing, just prepped it for turbo, and then built a custom intake manifold using half of the GT3 stuff, half of our components, half of IPD, put it all together. I mean, it still has AC, still has all the little creature comforts. I like the RPM from like 4,000 to 9,000. You just, just keeps going. That's it. And that works well with the gear ratios we chose with uh, Raider on the sequential. It's a Hollinger sequential gearbox. So what's it like street driving a sequential trans in this thing? You have to be so direct when you shift and you have to be on throttle because the ECU will only cut spark uh, after 30% uh, throttle input so you'll just take off in first gear you cruise and then in order to shift the second you actually have to get on the gas and then and then pull hard and then that's a real smooth shift but if you try to waffle around a little bit you know you get the jerk and everybody's looking at you and it's, it's so have you stalled this a few times it's not yeah yeah of course of course yeah, i've stalled this <laughs> so let's yeah. talk more about project swan the owner he he takes the car and he hammers the canyons and he does track days with it you know, and he, he's got two sets. Those are street tires, and then he's got Hoosiers on it. He wanted something visceral. His exact words were, we're trying to hang on to a dragon and spit and fire everywhere. So <laughs> that's mission accomplished. So does it shoot fire? It does. Oh, you're gonna shoot fire for us? I'm gonna try. <laughs> I'm gonna try to shoot fire. <laughs> All right, let's hear it. Okay. Would you like some anti lag? Yes. Where's the rest of it? Let's do it. Let's do it. All right, I think it's time to do burnouts and right, donuts. Let's, let's try to do a donut. Let me uh, let me get camera ready, okay? All right, I'm gonna just try one. Okay? Yep. It's a Porsche. So what? It's too much weight let on the rear. Let me ask you a question, Larry. How many wheels turn on your Porsche? Four, right? You got yeah. a pussy Porsche. <laughs> Poser. I got two, that got two. Poser. Hey, hey. I don't know how hey, to can you pass me that? Come on, Larry, please. No, no, no. Pick it up with your ass. Yes, please. Pick it up with your ass. No. Is that bad news? He ain't not hyperverse anymore. <laughs> <laughs> but he's still willing to do another one. That's why I love the tip. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God.
I think he's the first person to do it like Another one. <laughs> to finally come visit me. You are redeemed, sir. Yes. You are redeemed. The old girl can do it. Yeah, she rips. Nice work. Nice work. Man, that was, that's a lot of smoke. That put you drift, boys. Uh, hey, you threw some wing on some walls. You threw some wing. <laughs> you threw some wing on some walls. And you compare that to Pat's? That, I don't know, more smoke? That, yeah, the sketch level, wild. the sketch, sketch level is high. high. Yeah, this was yeah, sounds like this, yeah. this was high. Yeah. Yeah. Like, Especially when I got back in here, I was like, yeah. that foot break, like, that foot break. You know, you know. At the end of the day, no one cares if anyone crashes at 240. I got to be honest. <laughs> I got I to gotta be honest. I don't know much about you other than you build sick Porsches, but I was like, man shit, man shit, yeah. man shit. <laughs> So Hurt is kind of like the no fear guy. Not he's not afraid to get hit by a car, but apparently- Wild card. <laughs> he's hiding. I'm surprised you could fit those balls in that Porsche, right? <laughs> <laughs> he hides them under the hood.